So for the 13-14 season, for the first time we'll have four concerts in the Kaplan penthouse, all dedicated to contemporary music. And we will be introducing a number of new composers to CMS audiences for the first time, uh, including the Austrian Thomas Larcher, the German Detlef Glanert, the Argentinian Alejandro Vignal, among several others. And we're really looking forward to being able to bring these new voices to our audiences. So the first program in November features the new CMS2 artist, the Danish String Quartet. This is an astounding string quartet and we're thrilled to have them with us for the next three years. And they bring with them special repertoire. So they have a Danish composer who is also going to be new to our audiences, Hans Abrahamsen. And we're playing his 10 Preludes for String Quartet, which written in 1973, runs the gamut from aleatoric music to music that looks directly back to the Baroque. Um, in addition to that, they'll join CMS artists for a couple of other pieces, one of which would be Osvaldo Galahoff's The Dreams and Prayers of Isaac the Blind for Clarinet and String Quartet. The second program in February will feature CMS2 oboist James Austin Smith, and he'll be performing two works that will bookend the program, Elliot Carter's Quartet for Oboe and Strings and Mario Davidovsky's Quartetto No. 2 for the same instrumentation. It's interesting to compare these two pieces because they use the same instrumentation, um, but they're vastly diverse in, in terms of the sounds that they produce. In addition, on that program, we'll have two piano trios, one by Thomas Larcher called Kraken, and the other by Leon Kirchner, his second piano trio. And rounding out the program is a fascinating work by Wolfgang Riem uh, that's called Phantom und Escapade. The April program, is really built around percussion and CMS2 artist Ian Rosenbaum. He's brought to us a piece by Alejandro Vignal, the Argentinian composer, named Con Variations. This is a piece for solo marimba, and we heard it in his audition and were so thrilled with this piece and his complete mastery over it. If you close your eyes, you would swear that there were multiple players performing at the same time, that we felt that we had to include it. Also on this program is a piece by Osvaldo Galihoff called Marielle. It's a haunting and beautiful piece for cello and marimba. And closing the program is Fred Lairdahl's Fantasy Etudes for Ensemble and Percussion. So our final program, which will take place May 22nd, is a, a really wonderful way to end the season. It includes a CMS co-commission by British composer Hugh Watkins, who's writing a piece for cello and piano. Hugh's also a pianist, so he'll be performing it with his brother, Paul Watkins, who recently has taken over as the cellist of the Emerson String Quartet. In addition to that work, we'll have three other works by British composers, including Helen Grime, Oliver Nussen, and another short work by George Benjamin called Viola Viola, which surprisingly enough is scored for two violas. The final work on the program is a very special piece by Alfred Schnicke. It's simply called String Trio. It's meditative, it's reflective, there's mournfulness to it, but there's also a sense of possibility. So whether audiences experience this music live in the Kaplan penthouse or at home, streaming it live on our website, we are thrilled to be able to present all of this fantastic contemporary repertoire performed at the absolute highest level by wonderful artists.